With a new year just around the corner, it's a good time to look at your financial goals for next year. Target 12 consumer investigator Sarah Grinelli spoke with a financial expert about the top tips you can do now for the future. Sarah? Kim, Mike, the financial expert I spoke with says it's important to know when your money is coming in and exactly where it's being spent. So we broke it down her top financial tips. 2022 is coming to a close in a matter of weeks, making it the perfect time to look at your finances. One of the most common New Year's resolutions is to save more money. Donna Soa Allard, a financial planner for Soa Financial Group in Lincoln, says the first step is to look at your budget. So making sure that your spending is in line for your, with your budget and what you're actually doing is important. Once that's established, have a clear goal as to where you want your money to go. Put your money in the areas that you value most. So that means understanding what your needs are, certainly. But then what are your true priorities, like what's most important to you? And focus your money there. She says there are only so many places you can cut back, check your subscriptions or memberships you don't use. Plus, shop around for better deals so you can save some money. And make sure you have an emergency fund, she says, to use expenses rather than income when it comes to determining how much should be in your emergency fund. I would aim for six months of your expenses, not your income, but your expenses. That way, especially as we're potentially heading into a recession, if you find yourself uh, you know, out of work or with reduced hours, you've got some money to fall back on. She says it's also a good time to look at any investments you may have. Do you still have the right amount of risk in your investment portfolio? And uh, based on investment performance last year, has it shifted at all? So do a rebalance if it's shifted. So if you have some money for savings, instead of a regular savings account, make sure to put that money in a high yield savings account. Some of those interest rates right now are around 3%. Sarah Grinelli, 12 News.